Hello guys, from Mr. Ito, Safix, and today we have another video, and this time it is another episode of Transparent Mind. Now, I have no clue why the fuck my Karabit is completely black. Um, it looks pretty cool, actually. Let me just uh, actually log off Steam here. Um, and yeah, uh, it should be good. So today we're doing Transparent Mind. It's something that I haven't done for some time now. Um, but still, I mean, it's a really cool series. You guys really seem to love it. And hopefully what I will be doing today is I'm going to be recording a lot of Transparent Mind episodes. So I have uh, quite a few, you know. Um, so it's not just me making one and then, you know, you have to wait a fucking week to see the next one. I'll hopefully be making like, let's say, three, four today. And um, then that should be good. That's also why I decided to not stream today. Uh, it's Wednesday, uh, the 19th. So... Um, no, not the 19th. I think it's the 18th. I'm not even actually sure, but it's at least a Wednesday. <laughs> and I decided to not stream today because I've... Well, first of all, because my, my girlfriend uh, didn't have to go to school. Uh, or she decided to stay home because it was really so important what she was doing at uni. Um, and yeah, that is pretty much uh, status right now, but I'm trying to just fill the gaps here as I actually thought we were full, but it's currently not. We've got five players on one team now, though, so hopefully it shouldn't take too long. And uh, I'm playing on ECA. We've actually got full, team, that, full teams now. Well, I'm playing on ECA, and um, the reason for that is because this Transparent Mind series doesn't work very well if we meet cheaters, and generally on ECA you don't meet cheaters. So that's what we're going to be hoping for, and um, yeah, what I would like to focus on today, I've been thinking about how I should kind of make the Transparent Mind series better, I think I should make it better by focusing on stuff in every single episode, so this time I'll be trying to focus on flashes, and this is going to be Inferno flashes, obviously, since we're playing Inferno, it's a random map, uh, well, it, it got picked as a random map, um, so I didn't really know, but uh, it ended up being Inferno, and... Yeah, we'll just try to do some Infernal Flashes. What is, I'm, I'm not so much going to be going into depth with, like, um, set flashes on Infernal. I don't really know too many. I actually have a video about flashes on Infernal, which is actually really, really good. Uh, I, I really like that video, and I usually go back to it, actually. Um, but uh, I'm thinking more of, like, how to flash, when to flash, uh, stuff like this. Try to get this guy. Oh, he ran away. I guess should be hit now, right? Okay, this guy's full of speed. Oh, then he misses. Sad stuff. Sad story, baby. So we're gonna be starting on the T side, most likely, since in Pugs people seem to really like uh, starting off the CT side. I totally understand that. Um, we'll see what we are gonna be able to do here. I think I'm also gonna be trying to entry frag a lot of the rounds because I want to improve my entry fragging. Um, I mean, entry fragging is all about finding the right pace, you know, and uh, yeah, that's what we're going to be trying to do. I'm going to be buying armor first round. The reason for that is just because I want to be able to stay alive. Like, you can take pretty much double the shots to the stomach Hello. if you've got armor, and on ECA, people generally aren't too good. Um, so therefore, I'm hoping that uh, they just hit me ten times in the stomach and I still survive. <clears throat> so there's a guy peeking mid, they, he probably knows that we're going B now, if they communicate, they might know. Um, they are ready for us it seems. I'm blind now. And here we even see flashes come to effect. We need to get this guy fast. So I'm just going to be jumping over here. My teammate actually blocks the fuck out of me. Get a nice little shot on that guy. I think we need to push the coils guy. He's actually running away. Oh, that's very unlucky. The way that he ran away and then his teammate showed up. Um, he even had only 12 HP. I actually dinked him on that first shot. Didn't know. So it's impressive that my teammates didn't even hit him a single time. But um, it's okay. Normally I'd probably buy a Deagle here since it's just a pug. We are going to be going with a Tech 9. As that is probably the smarter choice. Especially on Inferno where like on these force by rounds. I think what you want to do is you want to get up close. Uh, mostly, like you don't want to be taking long range duels against the, an SMG or whatever with the EU because yeah, if you have limited cover and most places, for example on Banana, are easily nadable and if you try to play mid you can only replay Vietnam and that's quite some range for the Eagles. you need to hit a pretty sick shot but anyway, we're going to be trying with this Tech 9 
Um, I talked about my entry fragging, and yet I let my teammates go first here, but see what we can do. Um, I don't really feel... S oh, wow. Oh, wow. We're gonna be nading here. That's a good kill by my teammate. We're gonna be just edging our way forward here. See if we can find the guy that played over here. I'd like to check these angles. There's usually a guy here or here. But if he doesn't play any of these angles, it's probably because he's playing pit. Or balcony, I guess. That was definitely a cool shot. Uh, I don't understand. He hit me 40 from that range with an auto shock, and that's definitely not... Uh, that's very lucky. Um, this guy retaliation hasn't been too unlucky. That's a great shot, phenomenal shot. But he hit me yeah, 40 in two hits, and he only hit me once. Like, he only shot once, but shotgun shells count as multiple hits sometimes on Ishe. Um Yeah, it was a good... This is actually a problem. Okay, good. I'm on team speak. <laughs> I didn't know somebody came into my channel, but we sh this is about transparent mind. But I don't want to just minimize and actually leave the team speak now. Um, but yeah, it was a good shot I got on the balcony guy. I headshotted him through the door, actually, or like the wall um, first, which is why I went down so quick. If I hadn't, I'm sure he would have killed me. So it's not too bad. It's going to be taking a few shots through the smoke. We don't have too many bullets with this P250. We can jump up on this. I like this angle. Sometimes you can get a lucky headshot in. This is a problem, though. If this spreads. Doesn't seem like it will. Uh, but my teammate's dying now. Okay. I think we need to just be really quick here. It's unlikely that they're going to be here on the rotation already. Might be one CT. That's actually not. I'm going to be playing this side. Gonna be quick. I'm just gonna get the plan. Yeah. <clears throat> so we get a bit of extra cash. Uh, I kind of was a bit slow. It was a good decision to actually plan on this side of the site. Had a planted grill, which is probably the most standard plant. They would have shot me from banana. So um, that's actually also why I decided to plant in that spot. It was so that if they came from banana, I wouldn't be able to be killed. A lot of players plant standard grill, which is good because you can't be shot from CT and it's very easy to just get up onto the site and plant it there. But that position on the uh, other side of the site actually is, in many ways, a bit better because you can't be shot from banana either. But uh, I don't want to be taking any battles up mid here. The guys we were playing against actually seem to have decent aim. Was there a guy there? I'm not sure. Um... But I'm talking about flashes here, and it's probably mostly going to be about uh, CT flashes because it's hard as a terrorist to flash, I feel. Uh, you can need information of the whereabouts of your enemies first, whereas on CT you can ju kind of just flash and hope. Um, well, just like just like that. Didn't even know I was here. Throws a random flash down mid and catches me. Oh, there's a guy there. So that's a good frag. We're going to be playing this. A good flash there, maybe? Yeah, unfortunately, we couldn't really... Uh... Oh, we did actually get him. So that's great. I think A should be clear. Um, so we, we did get him on a good flash there. Bounced out from the wall so he couldn't see it. And then landed right in his face. And B should be clear now. Unless it's actually pit. There's no real reason to hunt him. But, uh, like, hunt the frag. So we don't have too good economy. But I'm, I feel pretty confident I can win this duel. What we can do is that he's probably he hasn't even made it out of pit, so that's that's first nice to know, okay? Then we can do it like this. Go behind me like this. Just try to see if we can. I want this guy to peek me. Yeah. So he tried to flash, but um, because I had stayed so passive and didn't actually try to hunt him. Uh, he came out and peeked my position and I could just dodge the flesh with that pillar instead of actually turning around So the reason why I decided to stay behind the pillar is because if he hides in sight My teammates hopefully are gonna be coming in from B and they're gonna get the frag no matter what so there's no real There's no real way he can actually stay alive in that scenario only if he kills me um, And gets down into pit, but I almost let him get down into pit which would which was probably a minor mistake but he didn't get into pit and uh, Still, it's hard for him to stay alive in pit because I'm so close, but I didn't want him down in pit, so I'm happy that I didn't didn't I didn't let him. Oh most of sandbags because my teammate says there might be a guy sandbags. There is. This actually I was just about to say there's actually multiples. 
but uh, there wasn't. We've got a guy CT. They've got a guy CT. Looks like it could be a s slight B stack here. Sky retaliation doesn't seem too unlucky with these sprays. Now this smoke is about to fade, so we're just going to be flashing. Oh. Yeah, that's the problem when you don't have a high sensitivity. <laughs> One guy's probably pool. Um, that's a well played round. Uh, it, um, he did say that he was like Tribox, I think, but I don't know why. My head thought that he was emo, so I thought I could actually take the battle against the guy's CT. Let's just turn these guys down slightly because they're a bit loud. Um, I thought that it was the guy was emo instead of like in the dark spot, but he was actually Tribox. And um, I thought that he couldn't really, like he wasn't probably going to be peeking me, but if he's Tribox, obviously he is going to peek me from there, especially now that he's got a gun. I'm not even sure if he actually had a gun. Um... But it just timed really awkwardly. Uh, the good, there was a good f flash timing uh, on the smoke fade there from me. I really should have had that kill, but I just, you know, got surprised that the guy was actually shooting me behind, and I was not un uh, quite sure what to do. We can put a flash here on this corner, and so if anybody's playing CT, they're gonna get blind, and we can try the entry. There's probably some guy playing fountain or some shit. He's playing up here. Oh, that's a good drag, Nato. The other guy, there has to be some other guy. Yes, there is. That's a great kill. It's a very important kill. We knew there had to be another. Um, I'm going to just be just mullers in the car here. I don't really recall that we actually got four kills here, but we did. And this guy is most likely not going to be going for it because we're money fucking them if we win this round. Meaning that they won a round and then we win the next. But I think I actually just... Oh, I couldn't see him. He could see me through the plant. I didn't think that he'd be holding that angle. Um, could have probably played it differently. I could have ran out instead of slow walked out. That gave him an easy shot. I could have also just focused on the plant. But I thought it was pretty unlikely uh, that he was going to be just standing holding that angle. Since, like, I don't think he actually knew I was there. I was slow walking down there. So I didn't think he'd stand and wait. But um, element of surprise was in his favor, not mine. But it was a good entry frag I got on that guy up on the the thing there. The, the boot spot, you know, on top of the oranges, whatever you call them. Like first, first box, I don't know. I'm going to be trying to go aggressive in mid, at least from the early round, because they probably don't have big guns. So if anybody peeks out, I want to get the early frag. And uh, with this, I think we're just going to be smoking off long. I'd like to do it like this. It's because uh, up in this area, it's more narrow, so the smoke never fails. Whereas if you smoke it here, it's very easy to actually play around the smoke. The only problem is they could be in this corner or this corner. But they're not, so that looks good. I think it's a B stack, to be honest. Uh, I'm just going to be falling back. I don't know. We actually should possibly be getting up mid. Just generally generally don't really like to entry frag but especially not this where it's like there's multiple angles i have to cover at once I think if a huge piece shoots me in the back then that's a good shot middle okay i'm gonna just be charging on through to the spawn one is pit they should be able to deal with this guy yeah they no that's not even him there's one more yeah some, oh wow, that's a great shot. How does he even know I'm there? Like why? It's really, really weird. This guy retaliation, he plays so weird. One, one come along now. Like, he's got good aim and all, but why is he slow walking into CT spawn? I doubt that his teammate could. Oh wow, I doubt that his teammate could see me running into. I mean, potentially he could see me run in there. Maybe he gave the information. That's actually likely that that's what happened. That's also why I think the death cam is just retarded. Can I have an AK, boys? He still in AK. Oh, for fuck's sake! 
that did give me one, but it's just like, why? <laughs> he threw his AK right when I was about to get thrown one. It's really weird, so I just had to go and get it. But fuck it. It still worked out in the end. No, no problem. Good flash here from the CTs. I like, ooh, I like this angle. Oh, that's not a good flash. Especially not when I'm holding this angle. But I just really like this angle. Like, it's very, it's a very common orb angle if you jump up here and peek, and you can basically only see the head. It's a very hard shot for the opera because you might not even be watching this angle as well. And it's good to shoot through smokes as well. Hello? User left your channel. Who, who keeps joining and leaving my channel? I don't get it. But, uh, fuck it. Still works. This again. Oh wow, I'm getting blind all the time here. It's a big kill. I, I need to return on this. I did. Is he pit or is he balcony? I'm not sure. Ah If only my teammate had been with me. I I I think I, I didn't think that he would be in that position. Look how slow my teammate is here. If my teammate had come out and cleared this, that would be one of the only positions he couldn't be in. I thought he was going to be close right, and that's why I, I didn't slow walk peek out. I didn't clear many angles. I just peeked out quickly because I thought he had... I thought the flash came from above, so he must have been balcony, you know? Um, but uh, I thought he would jump down and then, like, get up close. That makes it a really hard duel for me to win. Uh, because I also have to peek out very wide before I can actually see him. But he took a really weird angle and uh, made it hard for me. I'm going to be just going fast here, I think, if I can land this flash, and I could. Oh, it's well played by the guy Sandbanks. That's a good shot he hit on me. And my teammates are just way, way too slow here. Way, 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 way too slow. It's the case last round, it's the case again. Um, oof. This guy's probably not going to get a single kill. Yeah, he's going to be coming back. Um, but I need I need a good gun. I need some nades to work with. And then I need my teammates to... Like, if I'm going to be entry fragging, which I have been quite a bit, then I need my teammates at least to come in and get the, reven the, re the, re the revenge frag. But it just doesn't seem to happen. As my teammates just don't really know how to play the game. That's kind of the problem with playing EGA, I feel. Like, it's very, very random. Uh, it's very random about like whether or not you get served with decent teammates, decent enemies, whatever. That's what I don't really like about ECA. The matchmaking is so random. This is a good flash. Now we can probably peek this angle. We can. He's probably playing sandbags again. They're most likely playing the same setup since they had success. And it's not a you know it's not a high tier match or anything. So it's, it's maybe not. Maybe he's just defensive. No, they're actually doing well. It was a good decision not to play the same setup because I think we would have actually taken advantage of that. Now, because of how the money works out in our favor, who keeps joining my fucking channel? Hello? I, I the guy doesn't even respond. Now more join my channel. Nope. What is going on? Oh, wow. That is so unlucky. Um, hang on a sec. I'm going to just be lounge. And uh, then when people join the TeamSpeak, they obviously join the channel. Makes sense. Now I've left the TeamSpeak. Shouldn't be more annoying. Uh, I said that that was very unlucky. People might be, you know, uh, might not agree with me. But what I felt was unlucky was that my teammate was battling CT. And I hope that he would kind of, you know, have him. Maybe not kill him, but at least just have the attention of him. Then I could kind of counter face the site. Uh, but what happened was, as soon as I tried to jump, jump across, I got shot in the head through my teammate, uh, which slowed me down so much that I just ba barely could move. And uh, that's what I felt was unlucky because I couldn't even cross the pool, you know. What I tried was just a, a swift maneuver over to pool. But it was actually impossible for me because uh, I got shot in the head, very luckily. It's a hard game to get anything from. Um, I don't really have too many kills. We don't have too many rounds either. But it's... Yeah. 
it's all about you know who peaks first in that scenario it's quite hard to talk for me um i really hope that he doesn't tell me to move now because i've basically been entry fragging every single round here and he's been the one just waiting or at least my teammates have um but anyway it's it's hard uh the t the, like the ct is actually playing pretty well and it seems like they're playing setups well like they're playing an op one banana and then they're also playing a teammate to support him so for me to solo that it's it gets quite hard i have to kind of bait out the oppa's uh shot and then also kill the other guy looks like it's kind of a freebie here just gonna be smoking we're gonna this smoke might be something that we can use I was hoping that somebody might be peeking. There's a slight gap in the smoke. And with a bit of luck, I might have caught somebody peeking through the small gap. With my spray through the smoke, but uh, no one was peeking. There are only three. They don't have too many nades to work with, I would imagine. And they kind of have to stack one of the sites. So we're just hoping that we're making the right decision. But we probably aren't, to be honest. Uh, I think the last guy... I don't know if I heard him in CT or what. I would imagine that someone's playing anchor B. No, okay. That's weird. We made so much noise and yet they decided to s focus on the A-bomb side. But maybe that's because we got two quick kills there and then they just decided to stack that side. But about the flash usage, I'm going to be... Um, like, it's going to be... Uh, it's going to be clear for you guys what I... Uh, like what, what I wanna, what I wanna, what I wanna show on CT. Like ST, most of the flashes are pretty random. It's just like to get people out of positions or some shit, ready to catch them out. Uh, that's a good shot, especially because it was so random. Oh, we're just gonna go full on bombs to the walls here. Oh, he he catches me again and again. I've got a Molotov that he has to rotate in, so that gets a lot of damage done, but he was at Kyle. If my teammates had just, you know, tried to shoot through the smoke, they would have would have most likely gotten that kill, but I don't know. My teammates are pretty slow and boring, and uh, that's exactly the style that I'm trying to not play right now, which is just totally wrong for me, because if my teammates don't take the revenge rags, me getting entries don't really help much. But I did a lot of damage, and I got an, uh, an early kill, so that's good. Um, do you see a gun here? Maybe not. There has to be somebody. They can't all have rotated, then they're pretty stupid. But it does look like they all did, so... I mean, that entry frag might have actually proved uh, fruitful in the end. Now, we get another kill here. That's that's quite nice. And another, and the last one... Last one is low. He might be saving on B. We'll just call this to them uh, if they want to hunt. Yeah. yeah, but we have two guys on full HP and they don't want to hunt. We have decent economies, so that's stupid. There he even is, so they could just go for this guy. Like, this guy's solo. He's a bit of a chicken. I know he's going around killing chickens. How did that guy kill himself? That 40 HP, I did decent damage to him. Uh, not only by hitting him, but also him having to rotate through the Molotov. I gave him a bit of extra damage, which isn't, which isn't too bad. Um, I feel like my entry work is actually doing really well. Like, I'm doing it all on my own. I'm not really getting any any help from my teammates, you know. I'm simply uh, entering all by myself. No flashes, no smokes. And uh, it's going quite well, actually. But my teammates don't really get the rear entry. That means that all my hard work is pretty much... Uh, wasted, it feels like. So, I turn around because I could hear that flash just bounce, you know? I like to do this sometimes. Well, what I do is, instead of smoking off CT, I smoke off... Oh, wow. Oh, wow. That guy had a really, really weird peak. I don't understand why he would run through that smoke, but it's an interesting... But look at look at my teammates. This game is, is getting on my nerves already. They're so fucking slow. 
Like, the guy hasn't even pushed out. We've got top banana. We've had that shit for ages because I've been rushing it. And yet, they're just so fucking slow. But what I like to do is, instead of smoking off CT, smoke off the site. That's a good kill. Uh, and now he runs away again. I've done enough this round, boys. I'm out. That's what he says. I'm thinking maybe we should even check the chances of playing matchmaking in the future. Because this is just annoying to watch how slow they are. I don't think this would happen in global matchmaking. Um, like It's not like people are good in global matchmaking either. But... It's still, they know a bit more about the game, I hope. Um, but I like to smoke off the site instead of smoking off CT because it gets you, like, what you do with CT is you want a 1 versus 1 battle or <laughs> a 1 versus X battle on the guy who plays site, you know. Um, yeah, that's good. They actually went around, that's nice. Uh, <laughs> Um, but what you do by smoking off the site is that you instead get that one versus X battle towards the guy in spawn, and um, what kind of what kind of happens in that scenario is that you know if you smoke off spawn, I'm actually just going to take some time to spawn here to talk about this. If you smoke off spawn, then you can play the site. If you smoke off site, you can then play spawn. But if you get that kill in spawn, you can run through there and you can actually take over so much map control. And then you've got a guy in the site and you have a few rotators coming in. But if you can, if you can kind of uh, neglect, oh not, I keep using, but it, it like deny entrance to the site from the other players, like from the rotators, then you're really you're good to go, you know. And uh, the guy on the site should be easy enough to kill when you've got players coming in from both construction and uh, OCT. I'm gonna throw the bomb and I'm gonna be entering again. I'm gonna be Molotov summon over here because I could imagine somebody to be there. It does look like the case. Some guy over here though, he's dead. Now they're much faster, it's nice, it's very nice. I'm just going to be planning a standard plant. Um, well, it's not really a standard plant. It's a pretty standard plant, but I think the reason why they're actually fast this time is because my opponents were on pistols. And, uh, yeah, then it's much easier to get some nice eco franks. But, individually, the players we're playing against, they're okay. Uh, and that's why it's actually quite hard to get entries, especially when your teammates are just not helping you at all. You know, it's not even just the case that they're not getting the range frags. It's also just, you know, if somebody could entry with me, then it, there's a bigger chance that we can get the kills together. Um, well, we're going to be playing the CT side now, and hopefully we'll be able to see some flash work. Uh, we'll try to play B, because that's probably the best place to play, if you want to do a lot of flashes here. Um, I'd like to play B as well. I rolled it first, baby. Sorry. Um. Oh, these guys are idiots. Yeah, apparently they're really fighting for it. I'm trying to make a video and stuff, but yeah, fuck it. We're gonna be playing arches instead, I guess, because these guys don't really want to move. Um. Now, in this scenario, I'm gonna be playing just a passive position. I'm gonna be peeking out if they try to come short. Um. Oh my god. Two guys come short. I'm gonna be helping my teammate, we're gonna risk it, hope that this is gonna be a... Oh wow. Get one kill. If my teammate could help me, that'd be great. Oh, for fuck's sake, how does he let him go? I need to catch this guy. They're all coming through B. Um, well, one of them had even one HP, but we have a guy short who's bad. Well, we have a guy pit who's battling two guys short, and yet he doesn't even get a single kill, and I have to go and grab them both. Well, he just lets them entry into the site without really doing much. I don't really understand what that was about. Uh, there's not much we can do. Apparently, I haven't logged out of Facebook either, so we're getting messages there as well. I'm really sorry, boys. It's very sloppy work. I've, I've just recorded and I locked out of Facebook to do that, so I don't really understand how the fuck I'm still getting messages, but... Like I recorded a video right before this. I think I'm gonna throw these guys off the B-side soon. I'm really, really, really sorry. Um, 
Okay. This guy's getting a few kills. We'll try to get here. Uh, I unfortunately was looking at my phone for a second there, but could have actually helped my teammate, probably. We're gonna get a bit of a scrappy kill here. They're on B site. At least one more. My teammate should save me now. That's well played. That was what I was hoping for. Now, I think I'm actually gonna be smoking off here. Is it even planet B? It's planet A, boys. A. It's very important that you, like, listen to that shit. We're gonna be just flashing here fast because he could actually be anywhere in these aggressive positions and we need to be really fast. He actually was. Sick. If you don't have kit, you can make it. Yeah, and it's still he tries. I don't understand what he's doing. Why lose a gun on this, bro? Uh, don't really. Uh, they were the first guys on the site, and yet they. I have to be the one to notice that it's not B. Um, I'm gonna buy. Can I play B now? Okay, thanks. Because it's pretty retarded that we give up the site every single time. Um, but, yeah, it's I was the last guy on the site, and yet I was the first guy to notice that it probably was an A play, or like an A plan. I'm gonna be smoking here. If they rush through, then I'm ready with a flash here. This pops in pool, and it doesn't blind anybody but them, hopefully. It does seem like they might be getting closer now. Especially now that the smoke comes in here. Can you re-smoke, bro? Oh, it doesn't have a smoke, and I used both my flashes. So that's poorly played by me. Um, I mean, it's also the case that what you want is... What I generally want, at least, is that I want the site player to peek first. I like that the best. He might be playing me first because he heard a dink. He's gonna be here. Oh my god, NATO, you are just a fucking beast. My aim is actually so fucking on point. And I haven't even warmed up today. I don't think he's playing the site. Yeah, I'd be very surprised if he wasn't playing a bit. He's hit. <coughs> My teammates should really win this. Sick. Go plant. Uh, defuse. Nice. You're gonna make it. You're gonna make it. No, you are gonna make it, bro. You're gonna make it by like a half second. Half a second is what I was trying to say. Um. So that's a good round. It's good that they... Oh, there's actually a kit there. Why didn't he just fucking pick that up? Um, but anyways, it's decent stuff. And we got we got a first, our first round on the board. They got the plant again. Which is not so good. Um, but it was a very important kill. I got a library and then I got a second on the site. I think that kind of opened up the round. And I'm quite happy with how that panned out. But... Yeah, again. Two... This guy is very Danish nest if I wanted to see him for. So this is very nice of him. That's the climb smoke. So we're just gonna be smoking. I'm trying to communicate communicate with this guy. I like that the side player peaks first. Like he's always out peeking because I'm it's easier for me to be ready with flashes. But I think he is ready with a flash actually. I'm rotating. Um so I'm gonna be rotating now. They've given up the A site so many times and they already like the defense has been crippled. I'm gonna be trying just a bit of a pop flash here. I think I got that guy. Um, I wasn't expecting him to be in that position. But we're hoping... Yeah, we actually got a frag, so this makes the round doable. Yeah, I don't know what that guy is doing in mid. I think I even heard him. But it's... Uh, I feel like I'm playing retakes his go here. It's not good. Um, like, if I play A, they get into B. If I play B, they get into A. So I don't really know what to do. Uh, as, a, as a smart man once said, retaking is the hardest part of Cisco. This guy's solo, he keeps staying alive, also on, on T, and he's getting very nice statistics, but he's really not doing anything for the team. Like, it's his site that keeps getting taken out, and he just saves. Or like, hides. And it doesn't really help us in any way. Um, can you drop me a 5-7 solo? This is not a 
but uh, I don't I don't really know what I can do here boys I haven't even been able to actually use my flashes properly because I have to retake all the time and it's quite hard to use flashes to retake and here we go again so pretty sad I have to retake again what they said he came around arches but he didn't so now what I'm gonna be doing in this hit situation is that I'm gonna be trying to just see if I can find a frag solo should honestly just save his gun shouldn't even be going for frags here but any economic damage that I can do will help us not massively but it will help us and this is a decent crossfire setup that's a good kill solo should just get out of here yeah it's only a mag 10 though so it's not really too much Gonna be probably pushing me from here. Yeah, I kind of need a gun. I didn't want an M4, but Solo is making a lot of mistakes here. Uh, first of all, he shouldn't be coming to the B side. They've been playing A so much. We've had B on 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 locks on lockdown. And at the same time, he uh, like he should have not even gone for the first kill. He should have just let me. And then for the second kill, he definitely shouldn't. Uh, have gone for that so I don't know we'll see how the money works out we get 2400 so I can still get a decent buy and if I buy a deagle and feel like I need to work some magic here but it's hard when they don't really go for my side I don't want to go uh, and uh, you know I, I don't want to go for aggressive picks but so for some reason they're actually stacking towards B now and they are now coming B once again it's crazy feel like I'm fucking running all over the place all the time. Now they're coming A again, as soon as I rose to, to B, so it's pretty weird. He slid one guy past. Can he kill him, maybe? Oh my god. I'm yeah, probably gonna die, yeah. Uh, I fell down. Um, it's, it's really an annoying game, because this guy... If he had just shot the first player, then first of all, he wouldn't have died without getting a frag. And second of all, we would have most likely won the round. But I cannot peek through that smoke before he does something. And he keeps playing, you know, my sight. I don't really know what the, what's going on. But I'm trying really hard here to be a very good support player. Like, if they want to play B, then I go and play A. I'm taking the round of a support player here. I could just go aggressive every single round. And I probably could just wreck these guys. Um, but that's not what I wanna, because I wanna play good and like fundamentally sound Counter Strike. But it's my teammates are not really letting me, and it's kind of annoying because I'm doing what I can to actually make their jobs easier, and yet they're just making my job so incredibly hard. It's a good kill. We're gonna be spraying through the smoke a bit because I think there was another. Now we're gonna just grab this AK. We're gonna have to retake once again. Um, and the guy might even be CT. I'm not gonna really pay too much attention to him if he if he is. I'm gonna be trying to make my way faster into library because I think they want to take over this part of the map. If they go back B now. They're gonna be tryouting so fucking so much. Yeah, I didn't have I didn't have the money for head armor. Um, so single piece of fifty shot to the stomach. Oh well, to the head obviously is enough and it's very unlucky that he actually decides to grab his pistol like don't really understand but another round where we have to retake i think i'll ask them to let me play i can't even fucking spell properly but it's uh yeah i'm trying here to be a very very nice guy but i'm actually dying inside uh like the amount of times that these guys have killed me on t side like my teammates have and now the fact that I have to retake every single round, it's pretty fucking annoying. It's a very, very annoying game to play. Um, I will probably put out this video just to show, like, how bad a team you can actually have. Um, <laughs> in a sense, I know this sounds weird, but normally when I'm losing and stuff... Uh, in these, when I try to record these transparent mind videos, I tend to not put them out because... These are not the games where I get to really show you guys something new, something revolutionary, you know. Um, maybe not re revolutionary in that sense, but I this series is so that you guys can learn off of what I do. 
But it's not possible for me to teach you anything if I have to play some really stupid CS all game long. Um, and I am playing as best I can, but my teammates are really making it hard for me. And this time we're f for some reason playing 4A and now they're pushing B. So once again, I have to be playing retake CSGO. Um, and it's just not, it's not a, it's not a good game. This, I'm sorry if I may seem a bit annoyed at that fact, but I am. And I really shouldn't even be going for this, but um, I, I can't believe how unlucky I've been, you know every round and it's without fault i've actually been been retaken i haven't i haven't held the site yet where enemies came in i had a single kill on a guy who actually pushed my site the enemies just smoking here like i don't even know if i'll actually be able to save my gun if i stay here but they're gonna be rushing through the smoke in a sec yeah, i did actually die um I just decided to try and get anybody with me. I couldn't really get out because we had a guy was behind. Can I have an op, please? Can you drop me an op? Yeah, like um, I think. Oh my god! Give me that info, please. Oh wait, I've got one. Sorry, no one. Um, yeah. Like I hope you guys can even see. <laughs> This is not even like transparent mine anymore. This is just me whining a bit. I'm sorry, boys, but I hope you understand the frustration connected to this. It's, uh, it's quite a struggle. And again, this time I'm B, and this time they don't go B. I'm going to be staying for just a while, hoping, but it doesn't sound likely. No, they actually have the A side. So, seems like the end of the game. I don't mind it too much, to be fair. Um, I'm going to just be, obviously, playing this round out and hoping for the best. But, uh, yeah, they're already in aggressive positions. Very frustrating game. Um, I mean, if you cannot learn from me individually... We'll see here. Look how I even get the le least round win share. Because, yeah, fuck all. Um, I, there was a guy with four kills that have higher round win share than me? Okay. Which is also why, just that, that makes a pretty good case for. Uh, I just like, guys, just keep up the vids, Nato. Well, he'll probably see this. He was a pretty good player. Like I'm not gonna lie, he had some very good shots. He could, got into some good uh, positions, and he was very good. But um, as a closing statement to this video, uh, if you cannot learn from me individually, learn from, you know, what my teammates do. So don't be those guys because. This whole game, I've been trying to, like, fucking pull their asses over the finish line. And uh, time and time again, they just managed to fuck me up. So, uh, I, I couldn't, in this episode, unfortunately, really show you something individually. Because I didn't, I wasn't ever given the chance. Uh, not a single CT side round was actually played on my side. And all the T rounds, I tried to pretty much entry frag, and my teammates just didn't show me any support. So, um... If you cannot learn from me individually, which you probably can't this game because it was a very horrible game, like, whenever I got a battle, I hit a pretty nasty headshot, like, oftentimes I felt, but I didn't get very many fair battles, and uh, that's not, that's not, yeah, that's not easy. Um, but but try, to, try to avoid being like my teammates. This is a, a perfect case of why you should be able to hold your sights, obviously, but also help each other in sights and help each other take sights. So uh, I'm going to be releasing this, is what I've just made my mind up to, but... Um, a very bad game, very frustrating game, and I hope you guys can understand why and, and don't hate too much. <laughs>